Posters call you shawty and money. There's ain't no bone, can we rolling up the loud gun money? It's getting gone. On the phone now. No, but um, check it out, man. It's for all the beta male 2.0s out there, bro, bro. A lot of beta male 2.0s uh, hopped up on my, my no fat videos and semen retention videos, and they had a lot to say yesterday because. I was talking about how weird it was that they need to listen to other men tell them not to touch themselves while they watching other men do their thing. I mean, like, if that isn't common sense already, you feel me, bro, bro. But anyways, to my point, to my point, um, dang. Uh, that just threw me up. Anyways, like I was saying, though, man, all these dudes was tweaking up on my stuff, man, because I was saying how weird it is, bro. Why is no fap even a thing, bro? Like, like, bro, why is that even a thing? Why do you need another man to tell you not to touch yourself, bro, to while watching another man? Like, that, like, are, are y'all serious, bro, bro? Like, I just feel like people acting like females that need dreams to be sold to them. You know how females, they don't they don't care if you mean what you say. You know how there's some females, they don't care what you mean. If you mean what you say, you could just say whatever, but just make it sound good. Like, it's like that, bro. Like, for real. It's just like, y'all just like, uh, sell me a dream. Like, basically, that's what y'all like, bro. Like, for real, bro. Because y'all got to go watch these videos where these people tell you these are the benefits if you if you don't beat off if you don't touch yourself and be a weirdo every day then you can have this and you can have this and you can have this and you can have that and then that gives them the motivation the willpower to finally try not to touch themselves like are you are you serious bro are you serious, bro? And a lot of that stuff is over-exaggerated because you do realize just as many as y'all weirdos that beat y'all stuff every day, it's a lot of normal people out here that don't beat their stuff at all, bro, on some weird, on some real stuff. And they seem like pretty norm, normal people to me. Not, they don't got all them advantages y'all talking about, you feel me, on some real stuff, bro. Like, y'all just, y'all over-exaggerating and y'all taking it way too far, bro, bro. All y'all people on there that have to even why is no fap a thing? That's just what I'm saying, bro. Anybody that that's that that that's even a thing to you you beta male 2.0 on phone and grave. Yo, you took classes on beta male, beta male one on one. Fuck is you talking about like real shit, bro? If you gotta watch no fat videos, you are beta male 2.0. There's no way around it. All these people on here talking about MGTOW, men going their own way, M G T O W. You beta male 2.0 For real All these people Talking about like I just don't understand bro I just don't understand Me being a masculine male Full of testosterone bro I need to be balanced out There has to be balance So me being a masculine male Full of testosterone What balances me out A, a fucking feminine female Fuck is you talking about bro bro So I need some I need some female interaction In my life To balance me out bro On me I gotta walk around All day and carry this heavy ass motherfucker between my legs, bro. Fuck is you talking about? That shit get frustrating sometimes, nigga. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? Got me all tense and shit. I gotta carry this heavy ass motherfucker in between my legs all day. You feel me? And sometimes the shit get me a little frustrated. So I gotta go balance myself out and take it out on Shorty. Fuck is you talking about? Is she gonna balance me out? She gonna give me that feminine energy I need. Cause I don't got it within me, but I'm gonna get it from her. Fuck is you talking about? It's a lot of it's a lot of masculine testosterone and all that energy within me, bro. I can't get I can't I can't get all my all my fix of feminine energy from me. So I gotta go get it from a female, bro. She gonna balance me out. She gonna get me back relaxed. She gonna get me back cool. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? She gonna she gonna get me back comfortable, nigga. Y'all y'all anybody that. Anybody that really understand how the universe work and how the universal laws work know about balance, bro. So all y'all dudes walk around here talking about, oh, semen retention, oh, this and that, semen retention, I'm not having any sex, this and that, this and that. Fuck out of here, nigga. You unbalanced, bro. And you sexually frustrated, nigga. Ain't no reason I should be waking up in the morning rubbing my sheets. Rubbing myself against my sheets, nigga. 
Now I'm say, you sexually frustrated if you're doing that, nigga. You having wet dreams. Nigga, when you wake up, for, when you when you half sleep, when you first waking up and shit, first thing on your mind is women. Nigga, you fantasizing about women. First thing you do when you wake up, you're sexually frustrated, nigga. And all you motherfuckers on here, don't say you don't do that because I know what that's fucking like, nigga. I've been in junior high before, nigga. Fuck is you talking about? Nigga, I know it's like to wake up rubbing your sheets and shit. You are sexually frustrated, nigga. But guess what? When you get an ass, you don't do none of that shit. You don't have fucking wet dreams. You don't dream about fantasizing girls that you want to sleep with, bro. You don't do that. Your mind is not fixated on that. You feel me? You're not just walking around thinking about sex all day as much as you want to deny it, bro. Oh, semen retention, semen retention, semen retention. All you think about sex, nigga. And a lot of these motherfuckers that's doing semen retention or talking about no fat. It's talking about it's going to help them attract more girls. Like, that don't fucking make no sense. Trust me, bro. If you do see me in attention, you're going to attract way more women. And then guess what's going to happen when you attract them women? There's not going to be no more semen retention, attention, nigga. You're going to be fucking, nigga. The fuck is y'all talking about? For real, bro. What the fuck is y'all talking about, bro? The shit don't make no sense, nigga. You need some motherfucking balance, bro. Being sexually frustrated, that means you're not balanced, bro. Yes, yes, there needs to be there needs to be moderation to everything. Do everything in moderation. You're not supposed to overdo anything. For one, you shouldn't be touching yourself or masturbating, period. You feel me? That if you're doing that, it's most likely because you were lame. You can't get either you're too young, like you're if you're in junior high, we all been there, done that, whatever the case, or you or you just a lame, bro. Like for real. Once you get into high school, you should not be touching yourself no more. Now it's time to really get in the field. Now it's really now it's time to really play ball. Fuck is you talking about? Go get a real female. Weirdo. You wanna sit there and beat off all day? Like, come on, man. You don't need another man to hop on the internet and and make multiple videos every day. It, it's a lot of people, their whole channel is based on no fap and semen retention. That's all they talk about every video. You do not need a dude to hop on here every day and tell you that. You just need one motherfucker like me to tell you how much you being a fucking weirdo. Fuck is you talking about? Come on now. Let's get real, bro. And all y'all semen retention motherfuckers, these motherfuckers is motherfuckers that's fresh out of relationships, just got broke up with or something like that, so now they mad at all women. Talking about semen retention, I'm going to focus on myself, this and that, this and that, or some dude that can't get a girl, period, or whatever the case, but tell me, I'm telling you right now, bro. I'm telling you right now. Ain't no real high-value male really out here on that because if you a high value male or you prosperous or you successful you wealthy this and that bro or you just you just the man you feel me or whatever the case it is bro you most likely gonna have a high value female or few of them fuck is you talking about and you you mean to tell me if you got a nine or a ten around you good ass woman for bad chick she she riding for you she do she she be making sure you good all this nigga. You mean to tell me you not gonna be fucking her, nigga? Oh, semen retention day forty five, nigga. Get the fuck out of here, nigga. Get the fuck out. If you a high value male, more than likely you have a high value female or a few of them. Fuck is you talking about? And you not gonna just not fuck her, nigga, because she fine, nigga. And on top of fine, she do you right, and that make you wanna fuck her and treat her right. That make you wanna make her feel good. Fuck is you talking about? So you talking about you gonna go 45 more days without fucking your high value female nigga? Get the fuck out of here, nigga. You think she really gonna sit there and be listening? Oh, I'm doing semen retention, babe. Boy, she gonna be looking at your ass like I'll go fuck somebody else. Fuck it. I'm a you see how beautiful I am, I'll go fuck somebody else on your ass. Like fuck is you talking about <laughs> on me? Talking about some semen retention, this and that. Any motherfucker that's fucking a bad female, a 9 or a 10, a fine-ass female, know how high energy they are, bro. I'm talking about you as a man. If you fucking a fine-ass female, that raises your confidence all the way through the roof, nigga. You're going to be a high energy like a motherfucker. You gonna, and that's going to that's gonna raise your confidence in other shit that you do that don't even involve women, bro. You're going to carry yourself better. You're going to poke your chest out, nigga. You're going to walk with a swag, nigga. Fuck is you talking about? That's high energy, nigga. You're going to be confident within yourself. You're going to love yourself even more because you got one of the most beautiful females in love with you, bro. Uh, the woman that all the dudes want, all these dudes chasing, they always liking all her pictures, commenting on all her pictures. But guess who's smashing, though? You know how that's going to make you feel on the inside? Nigga, you're going to be, they damn near going to be calling you cocky. But real, a whole time, real talk, it's just high, a high amount of self-love. You're going to have a high amount of self-love. And when you're walking around in energy like that, you can have whatever you want, nigga. Not, just, not because you're not skeeting or you're not nothing. 
Nigga, you can have whatever you want. Now when now when we wanna talk when we wanna go in and talk about nothing and we wanna talk about orgasms, this and that, nigga, that's the highest when you're orgasming, you're in the highest vibration that that uh, that you can possibly be in in this physical realm that you can possibly be in in this flesh while you're orgasming you are in the highest vibration that you can possibly be in in this flesh bro understand that bro so the thing is y'all need to learn how to transmute that energy it's called i think it's called sexual transmutation or something like that or whatever the case it is bro but basically you take your orgasm and you you hone it within yourself so instead of fully releasing you feel the you feel the feeling of orgasming without actually releasing your nut which is very hard to do but i i can do it though i can do it but it's very hard to do bro but that's where that's where real power come in if you could go have sex with females and not bust but raise your raise your level to that orgasm but not but not release the actual semen Bro, that's when you that's when you really working with something, bro. Learn about that. I think I believe it's cause the at the term for the sexual transmutation. Fuck is you talking about? But yeah, you convert that orgasmic energy and you keep it within yourself. You don't release it. Like real stuff. That's how you that's how you reach other levels, bro. And some real shit. And people don't even know about that. Come on, man. Stop playing with me, bro. Stop playing with me. Y'all mad because I'm talking about these weirdos playing video games all day and you you beating your meat and y'all got to go watch videos of other men telling you not to do it. Other men that probably beat they meat too. Like for real, man. Come on, man. And, and anybody, especially if you out of school, but if you in high school and out of school and you, you beating your meat, you a fucking lame. Somebody needs to tell you that you're a fucking lame. Get your shit together, nigga. Get outside. Go, go meet people, nigga. Go talk to people, bro. For real, for real, bro. And like I said, all these people talking about sexual, I mean, uh, semen retention, more, more times than not, they're not high value males, bro. Because if they was high value males, they wouldn't be able to keep women away from them. For real, bro. For uh, I can't explain it. And anybody that's a high value male or they used to attracting a lot of women, they they already know how I'm coming. They already know. They are, they understand me perfectly, bro. Nigga, you can't, if you a high value male, you can't even keep women away from you, bro. It's hard to even keep women off of you, keep women away from you. So y'all niggas talking about semen retention, this and that, this and that, bro. Nigga, if you a high value male, you probably got some fine ass females around you, bro, on me. And like I said, if it, there has to be all balance, nigga. There has to be balance, nigga. There's balance in the universe. There will always be balance. And when something gets unbalanced, the universe gonna correct your ass, nigga. Some way, somehow. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? So me being a masculine male with a whole bunch of testosterone, carrying this heavy ass motherfucker in between my legs all day, nigga. I, sometimes, nigga, I need to go release. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? You know how it feels to have to carry this heavy motherfucker in between your legs all day, nigga. So shit, I'm gonna have to go. I need, I need my dose of feminine energy, bro, bro. I been, uh, you know, it, it's hard work being masculine all day and shit. It's hard work. It's hard work being pumped full of testosterone and all day and shit. So I need some feminine energy to balance me out. And since I I don't have a a, a whole source of feminine energy within me, I'm gonna go to a to the plug. I'm finna go hit up my plug. Fuck is you talking about? And right now, actually, I'm finna go hit up one of my plugs, nigga. I'm finna go get over my milf right now, nigga. Fuck is you talking about cougar shit? Fuck is you talking about, nigga? You ain't, hey, y'all ain't, y'all don't know shit if you ain't had no milk yet, nigga. She gonna treat you like one of her kids, nigga. Nigga on me, nigga. She gonna take care of your ass, fruit snacks, juice box, and all, nigga. Fuck is you talking about? Y'all last ain't experiencing life about this bitch, nigga. This motherfucker finna come to an end, nigga. And y'all niggas wasting y'all time playing video games and beating off and shit. This shit finna end real soon. Society as you know it, nigga. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? So your ass better get right. You better get right. You better hope you right with the most high. You better hope you 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 right with the motherfucking source, bro. On me. For real, for real, bro. And y'all niggas talking all this fuck shit and all this this motherfucking weak ass shit. Y'all sound like weak ass men, bro. When did men lose their way? Y'all sound weak as fuck, bro. On me. And my people look up the history of my people. We used to have a multiple women, bro. On me, even when they when they was taking us as slaves from Africa, we had multiple women over there. When they brought us as slaves over here, we had, we had multiple women over here on the plantations. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? If you look in our history, look in the Bible, nigga. Looking, the Israelites had multiple women. All that, bro, bro. 
It's in our blood. So everybody look at man. Black man just can't settle down. This man, it's in our blood, bro. And if you wanna if you wanna be statistical about it, there's seven black women for every one black male. Cause the the rest of us either die or get locked up, bro. So that's the only way it's even gonna work. We a rare commodity. The black man is rare like gold out here, bro. On me. We meant to have to have I mean, not all of us though. If you can't handle multiple women, it I'm not saying if it's not your thing, it's not your thing. But for those of us that it is your thing, shit, don't 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 diss them. Y'all can accept all this homosexual stuff out here, all these men on men. Y'all can accept a man sucking another man. You know what? Y'all can accept a man bending over for another man and taking it up his ass. But y'all can't accept a, a man with two girls. The fuck is really going on around here, bro? What the fuck is really going on around here? Because if you if you open up that Bible. And I, I'm not saying I agree with the Quran or Islam, but if you open up that Quran, it's clearly the 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 Most High, the Lord God, had no problem with a man having multiple women as long as they was his wives and not somebody else's. What you talking about? But like I said though, I'm finna go hit up my plug, one of my plugs right now. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? My cougar shit, she finna do me right. Fuck is you talking about when I'm finna release, nigga? Because now y'all got me sitting on this bitch having to explain myself. And I already made a whole video talking about uh, not sorry for the misunderstanding or whatever. Because I don't give a fuck about being misunderstood, bro. But, you know, I feel like I should touch base on this one a little more, you know. Just, just, just to really explain myself and where the fuck I was going with this, bro. On phone them grade, bro fuck is you talking about but i'm finna go get balanced out right now while you niggas while you niggas sit there and hold y'all shit in and rub y'all sheets in the morning and have wet dreams fuck is you talking about y'all do that fuck is you talking about lame ass nigga. put some on you so cold nigga